Hi, Chris Good from Decatur Makers here, and this is a tutorial video on how to use the Roland Cam 1 CM24 vinyl cutter. Uh, step one is to turn everything on. There's a power strip that's hooked up to the cart. Just flip the switch and then reach inside the cabinet to turn on the computer. Just press the power button and the computer will boot up into Windows. You'll need to sign on with the login administrator. Uh, sorry, with the login admin and the password administrator, all lowercase. The next step is to turn on the vinyl cutter with the power switch right here, clearly labeled on the side, and to measure your piece of vinyl. So here's our measuring tape. This piece of vinyl is about 24 inches long and about 12 inches wide. We're going to feed it into the vinyl cutter and then have it measure it too. So lift the release lever on the side and just feed that vinyl in, making sure it's aligned pretty straight. And also make sure that the rollers are above the hashed marks on the roll bars. They're at about 1, 12, 18, and 24 inches from the left side of the vinyl cutter. So feed that piece of vinyl in, make sure it's straight, and then drop that clamp bar down. Then press the setup button, the top button on the right side of the vinyl cutter, making sure that it is indeed powered on. There we go. Set up, allow it to go through its thing. It'll measure the width and then it'll suck your vinyl into the machine. Let's try that one more time. There we go. It'll measure the width and then suck in the length of the uh, piece of vinyl to measure that as well. Now we're ready to go to the software side. Once you've loaded the vinyl into the vinyl cutter, open Corel Draw X3 in Windows and uh, load a new document. Then from the file menu, select print. Well, we don't have anything to print yet. Let's try this. Uh, we'll put a little design in there. All right. And we'll select print from the uh, from the file menu. And under the properties menu, we're going to enter the width, which was 12 inches, and the length, which was 24 inches, of the vinyl that we measured by hand. And click OK, then apply. And then we're going to close the print window. Next, from the file menu, we're going to select document setup and choose page setup. Then, we're in the, under the size menu, we're going to select set from printer and click OK. All right. You can adjust your design some more, um, you know, expand it, contract it, put on all of the uh, any text that you want to for your design. Before you print though, you should check print setup to make sure, sorry, you should choose print preview from the file menu to make sure that that is uh, where you want it to be on the page. If it's not, you can move it to the right place uh, and then select print from the file menu and watch the vinyl cutter do its work. And that's how to use the Roland Cam 1 CM24 vinyl cutter.